Gencycla is a medication used to prevent pregnancy, often called the mini pill, because it does not contain estrogen. It contains norethindrone, a hormone that prevents pregnancy. This form of birth control is more effective than certain other methods, like condoms or diaphragms, but less effective than combination hormone birth control. It is usually used by women who cannot take estrogen. To reduce the risk of pregnancy, it is important to take this medication exactly as prescribed. It's important to note that using this medication does not protect against sexually transmitted diseases, so it's important to also use protection against STDs. Before taking Gencycla, make sure to read the patient information leaflet provided by your pharmacist. This leaflet contains important details about when to take your pills and what to do if you miss a dose. If you have any questions, ask your doctor or pharmacist. Take Gencycla by mouth once daily at the same time each day. You can take it after your evening meal or at bedtime if you experience stomach upset or nausea. It's best to start taking this medication on the first day of your menstrual period, but if you start on any other day, use an additional form of non-hormonal birth control for the first 48 hours to prevent pregnancy. Continue taking one tablet every day, and start a new pack the day after finishing the last tablet in a pack. There is no break between packs, and you do not take any reminder tablets. Your periods may be irregular, and you may experience vaginal bleeding between periods. Do not stop taking your pills if this happens. If you miss a pill, start a new pack late, take your pill at a different time than usual, or experience diarrhea or vomiting soon after taking a pill, use a backup method of birth control every time you have sex for the next 48 hours. Consult the patient information leaflet, your doctor, or pharmacist if you have any questions or concerns about how to switch from other forms of hormonal birth control to Gencycla. If you experience nausea, vomiting, headache, bloating, breast tenderness, or weight gain, these are common side effects. You may also experience vaginal bleeding between periods or irregular periods. If any of these effects become bothersome, consult your doctor or pharmacist. It's important to note that many people using this medication do not experience serious side effects. However, you should contact your doctor immediately if you notice lumps in your breast, changes in mood such as worsening depression, severe abdominal pain, or unusual changes in vaginal bleeding. Additionally, seek medical help right away if you experience a serious allergic reaction, such as rash, swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. Keep in mind that this is not a complete list of possible side effects. If you notice any other effects not mentioned here, consult your doctor or pharmacist. If you are in the U.S., you can report any side effects to the FDA at 1-800-FDA-1088 or at www.fda.gov medwatch. In Canada, you can report side effects to Health Canada at 1-866-234-2345. Before taking Gencycla, it's important to inform your doctor or pharmacist if you are allergic to norethindrone, other progestins, or any other allergies. This medication may also contain inactive ingredients that can cause allergic reactions, so it's best to discuss this with your pharmacist. It's important to discuss your medical history with your doctor or pharmacist before using this medication, especially if you have had abnormal breast exams, cancer, especially endometrial or breast cancer, low levels of good cholesterol depression, diabetes, severe headaches slash migraines, history of jaundice during pregnancy or while using hormonal birth control, liver disease, or unexplained vaginal bleeding. Before undergoing surgery, make sure to inform your doctor or dentist about all the products you are using, including prescription drugs, non-prescription drugs, and herbal products. Gencycla may cause dark areas on the face and skin, and exposure to sunlight can worsen this effect. It's important to limit your time in the sun, avoid tanning booths and sunlamps, and use sunscreen and protective clothing when outdoors. It's crucial to avoid using this medication during pregnancy. If you become pregnant or suspect you may be pregnant, it's important to inform your doctor immediately. Gencycla can pass into breast milk, so it's important to consult with your doctor before breastfeeding while taking this medication. Regarding the daily dosage and optimal timing, it's important to take Gencycla at the same time every day, with or without food. Missing a pill increases the risk of becoming pregnant, so it's important to take it consistently. If you're starting Gencycla for the first time, it's recommended to start on the first day of your menstrual period. If you start on a different day, 
use backup birth control for the first 48 hours. When taking Gencycla, it's important to be aware of potential drug interactions that could affect how well the medication works. Some drugs may decrease the amount of birth control hormones in your body, making it less effective and increasing the risk of pregnancy. It's important to inform your doctor of all the medications and products you are using, including prescription, non-prescription, and herbal products. If you start any new medication, be sure to discuss with your doctor if you should use additional reliable birth control. It's also important to notify your doctor if you experience any new spotting or breakthrough bleeding, as these may be signs that the birth control is not working effectively. Additionally, Gencycla may interfere with certain lab tests, potentially causing false results. It's crucial to make sure that all lab personnel and doctors are aware that you are taking this medication. The recommended daily dosage for Gencycla is one tablet at the same time every day. It is important to take the medication consistently and at the same time each day to maximize its effectiveness. Gencycla can be taken with or without food, but it is essential to follow the instructions provided by your doctor or pharmacist. If someone has taken too much Gencycla and is experiencing severe symptoms like passing out or difficulty breathing, it's important to seek immediate medical help by calling 911 or a poison control center. Symptoms of an overdose may include severe nausea, vomiting, and sudden or unusual vaginal bleeding. If you have any concerns or questions about the use of Gencycla, consult with your healthcare provider for personalized advice. Remember to take Gencycla at the same time every day, and if you miss a dose, refer to the package insert for instructions on what to do. It's important not to share Gencycla with others. While taking this medication, it's essential to have regular complete physical exams, including lab and or medical tests such as blood pressure, breast exam, pelvic exam, and pap smear. It's important to follow your doctor's instructions for examining your breasts and to report any lumps right away. Make sure to keep all medical and lab appointments and consult your doctor for more details. When taking Gencycla, it's important to take it at the same time every day. It is usually taken once a day, with or without food. It's best to choose a time that is easy to remember and take it consistently at that time every day. If you have any questions about the best time to take Gencycla, consult your doctor for more information. If you miss a dose of Gencycla, refer to the product package information for advice on what to do next. It's important to use backup birth control, like condoms or spermicide, to prevent pregnancy. If you have any questions, be sure to ask your doctor or pharmacist for guidance. If you find that you frequently forget to take your pills as directed, it's a good idea to talk to your doctor about possibly switching to a different form of birth control that may be more suitable for you. When it comes to storing Gencycla, it's best to keep it at room temperature, away from light and moisture. Make sure to store it in a place that's not the bathroom, and always keep it out of reach of children and pets. When you no longer need Gencycla or it reaches its expiration date, it's important to properly dispose of it. Don't flush it down the toilet or pour it into a drain unless instructed to do so. Instead, consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for the best way to discard it. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.